What's up guys, it's KCube and welcome to 2018 How to Survive video of something I will talk about later. Anyways, I'm telling you that I've been gone for a long time for three reasons. Number one, I am now a club basketball star. Just kidding, I'm a player. Number two, I am now a soccer player again. Number three, I'm a newly inducted NJHS member. Party. I can't see you down there. It's not enough points. I'm just kidding. <laughs> so today, I'm going to be teaching you how to survive science. Let's get to it. All right. Science. How to survive it. I don't know what you want me to say. Everybody who's in my class knows you can't survive science. You actually cannot survive. No matter what I tell you, you're gonna get there and you're gonna be dead on the inside. So you might as well just suck it up and go right through it. Like the science part is like half of it. The other half of it is who teaches it. I'm not saying that I don't like her. I'm saying I don't like the way she teaches. That's all I'm saying. I just, I can't do it. So I'm gonna tell you how to not be as dead inside by the end of science. You could, you're, you're gonna die. You're just, you're just dead. Like science is, it's a deadly subject, you know? So I want to say how to survive being only, you can't survive. So should I put how to kind of survive? How to not be completely dead inside? After so I don't know, but <sighs> all the clips. So wanna know how to not die in science? I got you. Sit in the front. If you can choose where you sit, sit in the front. Because if you sit in the back and you're not paying attention, you'll get called on. And if you don't pay attention, if you actually don't pay attention, you're going to get called on and you're gonna look, mm, you're gonna look uh, not smart in front of your peers. That's not fun. Or, what might happen, you might just get called out when you are in the front. But when you're in the front, you're paying attention because you can see the board. I'm blind, so when I sit in the back, I just can't see. And I get in trouble all the time for not paying attention. So sit in the front. If you can choose, sit in the front. Because, honey, let me tell you, sitting in the front is your best option. That is only the first option. We got plenty more to go. Like, plenty more to go. Sitting in the front. Alright, let me just continue on this one. Because I I never get the chance. We don't get to choose. <laughs> like, it's like, oh, you're an adult. You have to make good choices. You can't choose where you sit, though. If you want us to be responsible, you would tell us, be responsible, sit by someone who you won't talk to. And then if we talk to that person, give us a lunch detention. Like, this is how the world works. You don't get to choose for us. If you say we're as responsible, if we're as responsible as you say, wouldn't we automatically just do the right thing? What? Step number three. Is that two? Jeff, is it two or three? Two. Step number two. There's only three. And I know I said there was a lot in the earlier clip. Just ignore everything I say unless it's good. Mm -hmm. So, step number two. Actually pay attention. Science is a hard class. It's, it's one of the hardest things I've ever had to do. And I still don't pay attention. I get... I still have a good grade. I have a C. <laughs> good grade, am I right? 
My parents don't let me play sports if I have a C, but it is not my fault. I have a C. I'm not going to get into it because this video would be 30 minutes long and I'm just going to make it about seven or eight. But listen, pay attention. If she asked you what the quadratic formula of 53 times 21 is, answer it. If you don't know, you don't know, but you have to try. You have to sound educated, at least a little, I just a little bit. I've used this, I'm gonna stop using that. You have to sound at least a little bit educated. You can't just be like, all right, what's Newton's first law? Snakes! What? What? Where'd that come from? Harold. Dang it, Harold. Snakes? Really? You've been watching Kevin Durant again? <laughs> uh, if you're on my basketball team, um, you understand this. Kevin Durant. Snake. Anyways. <laughs> no, no. Pay attention. Focus. Focus! How did Ariana say it? Focus on... No, that's... Just focus. Okay. Alright. I don't pay attention. I have ADD. I have an excuse. I still don't pay attention, though. Like, if I didn't have ADD, would I still pay attention? Probably not. But I'm telling... Like, try to pay attention. I still leave mostly dead inside, but... Some of these tips help, like sitting in the front. I sit in the front. I still get some help. You know, try it, try it. Maybe if I pay attention, I would have a better grade. Huh, my mom was right. The last and final step to not being completely dead inside after science is to butter up the teacher. If you wouldn't get her to like you, or him, gender equality, if you can get them, them, to like you, you're pretty much A plus to high school, you know? They'll send you off, give you some cupcakes when you leave, you know, and you just gotta hug them like you like them. I'm not saying if you don't like them. I'm not saying I don't like my team. I'm not saying that just in case, you know, someone from my school shows this to faculty. I'm saying this is how you, I don't like science because I don't like science. That's all it is. I don't pay attention sometimes. And okay, bring your teacher some flowers when it's teacher appreciation week or some, or some candy, Skeetalays. That's what it is. If you, if you don't understand me, Dire Fire gets it. Not the point. Bring some lovely, lovely food to your teachers, all of them, not just one. And you might get an A+. Plus. You might just like, like you'll, what I'm saying is this could get you an extra point. Like if you misspelled photosynthesis, the, the candy might make her be like him or her gender equality. I don't judge. Might make them, them, them be like, you know, what? She's been, he or she, gender equality, has been really good this week. I might as well give them, I might as well give them the point. They earned it. You know, you know what I'm saying? Bring candy. Everybody loves candy. Unless they don't love candy, in which case they are the devil. Whoa, hey, that's enough of that. You, mm, I need to stop. Why didn't my editor say anything? <sighs> Whoever edits these videos is fire. Oh, I edit them. <laughs> Anyways, those are the three steps to not be completely dead inside during science. Come back today or tomorrow and we will be doing how to survive writing slash English because English teachers are always like it's English but we're like it's writing English is English you speak English you you get the point anyways thank you guys so much for watching I apologize for not being around um but 
if I make it up, then you know, it doesn't count, right? So um, I'll see you guys soon, next video. Catch these hands. That should be my end. No, that's bro fist, ain't it? Dang it, elbow. Fin, noggin, dude. <laughs> we'll just do the fin, you know? I'll, we'll figure it out. Comment down below what I should end my videos with. Please like, comment, subscribe, and your question of the day is, do y'all have any pets? Comment down below how many pets you have, if you have any pets. If not, comment down below, tell me you hate me or something, I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> but comment the daily question of the week or day, daily. Did you hear what I just, daily question of the week? I quit, I'm, I'm done. I will see you guys next video. Bye-bye.